guys were I was just smoking in Buffalo or New York and Buffalo, as you want to say. And then it was handed over back to the train in the other direction. However, there was equipment like that car we're going to go through in the city of Lima, meaning Lima, Ohio, uh, Lima if you're from Spain. And <laughs> and um, the, uh, the car was built in 1950, that car, for the, by Pullman, for the nickel plate railroad. And what they did was they wanted to compete with the other big railroads that had New York, Chicago routes, like Erie, New York Central, you know, Pennsylvania, B&O. You know, and they couldn't do it unless they combined their services. That's why they all met in Buffalo and went on. But uh, this uh, this car has been trying to, we try to restore it as much as we can to the original. And it's in full operation, the kitchen, all the meals were cooked in that kitchen Saturday and Sunday and many others before. Okay, so we used to be in Scranton. We had we moved all the cars here because this is our new home now. Okay, so you guys can follow me into the city oh, of London. So hot. Yes, that's so hot. Yeah, I love it. This would be into this one. Oh. Oh. This is where well, okay. it's a sleeper. All right, so this is a 10 6 sleeper. Mean it. Does anybody say oh, no? Okay, 10 6, meaning 10 individual roomettes and six bedrooms. Each bedroom could be converted into a double bedroom. So you can have either six single bedrooms or three double bedrooms or any combination thereof. Okay, when the car was uh, out of service and it was stored here at Port Jervis for two years, I'm not gonna talk over those people. When it was stored here, they, it, it was owned by, uh, bought by private owners. They had to convert the toilets to sanitary toilets, so they converted number one and number eight on the other end to toilets. The rest of these rooms are single roomettes. You can look at them. We have a lot of stuff stored in it, so don't worry about it. Come on through. This one is in the, in, the, in nighttime configuration. Yeah, the, uh, wow, 1950s roomettes. <laughs> If you go by around this corner, you'll see a lit board on the wall. It says number five, because I pressed the button here. That tells the porter what room is calling for service. <laughs> That's nighttime. In nighttime room ads. Come on, guys. Wow. That is cool. Go ahead. And it still works. Wow. I guess. Anymore? Anymore? Wow. I guess this is what. I guess this. I guess this was. This what. I guess this is what they mean living on the railroad. I guess this is what they mean living on the railroad. Yes. Living on the railroad. Yeah. Right. <laughs> like, that's okay. a closet like that. All right, there you go. Now the next room, C and D, that's the same kind of room in daytime configuration. All right. Yeah, it had four beds. See how the bed is now a seat. Mom, I want to go on a train like this right now. Put your shoes. Then you put your shoes in here at night. I don't think I can stay here that long. Trying to be a good back. Yeah, that was a service that opened. So you don't ever want to go on a train with me? Wow. It got expensive when Amtrak took over. Of course, yes. I'm sure. Good old Amtrak. On that corner, you see the other five uh, roomettes. Some of them are in daytime, and there's one in nighttime configuration. If you want to uh, see that, then when you're ready to leave, just make it about facing about the same way you came in. Oh, it's so in the wall. Yep, that's how they configurate it actually is built in the wall. Oh that's nice. Hey, what is this room? What would happen? Yeah. Oh man. Here, come on in, Chad. Can we all fit? Oh imagine trying fitting You can fit in here too. Look, man. Don't anyone try to move. Now that you're all in there, don't try to move. All right. Okay, we're going to sleep. All we have to do is is Take a train all the way across the country like this now. <laughs> we'll be like that this is the true form three of days. bonding. <laughs> that is definitely the true form take, of bonding. Take, take, taking a you train like across a, the country. You look like a train fan. That, you know, is, with these guys, well, that is family yeah. togetherness. Uh, yeah. <laughs> right there. Yep, we're going back to the fire. Say thank you. Come on. <laughs> well, we haven't gotten to the mail. Say thank you. That's a really big train, huh?
Oh, they are. I know. Especially because Nickel Plate Railroad is one of my favorite Midwestern railroads. And where did it go?